All right, hello boys and girls. How's everybody doing? Back in Cyberpunk 2077. What do you do? What the? <laughs> Who are you? Uh, Phantom Liberty. Uh, trying to wrap up this Days and Confuse mission. Ay ay ay. Uh, I'm sorry for the side track, but man, this game is beautiful. What is this? Looks like the Fire Princess from Adventure Time. But not from the front. <laughs> Is that? Oh yeah, that must be the black sapphire. Interesting. Oh, there's double diamonds. I thought it. I thought it was something else. You're wearing my faceplate. You even copied my shoes. Have you no shame, bitch? I won't let this go. These looks are copyright protected. Okay? You will be paying me for the rest of your life. Your looks, that's all. Yours? Bags, shoes, glasses, all custom made. Lena Melina is a registered trademark. You fucking copycat bitch. Okay, like this is fucking weird. How am I even supposed to act? All right, people. Director on set. Someone's got to take the reins. So great to have you back. Tell me he's your sister. Okay, let's do the send tools. Like, here, your lines. Just sending you your lines. Just read them out loud. Okay. Got them. Dear Lina, I've been following you ever since the beginning when you were making those crazy amateur BDs with those bikers from the Badlands. Keep going. I'm going through a difficult time right now. Life kicked me pretty hard in the ass. I can only get a break when I'm being you. Thanks for the preem content. I know you're putting your body and soul into these BDs. Your biggest fan, Edgar Toole. Whoa! And he's back. You look just like Lena Molina. I am Lena Molina. Listen, I know life is hard, and you do stuff to try and escape, like pretending to be someone else. But at some point, you have to accept who you really are. We all do. Am I being bunked? <laughs> Formulaic conventional narratives are so last gen. This is art, okay? A study of the labyrinth of the human soul. With a bunch of amateurs, I'm out of here. Shank, don't sell her any more BDs. Uh, thanks for the help. Settle your fee in a sec. What the? Shank, what the fuck am I wearing? Uh, hey, Can't believe I'm too. saying this. Glad you're but back. sometimes you actually manage to do shit back. right. Gee, <laughs> thanks. Yeah, exactly. Thanks, Johnny. Customers into this. All right, let's see what was his message. G called for a psychiatrist, not a merc. Jim got stuck meeting with someone else. Thankfully, he managed to help him. Now he's back to his old self. See why you had your doubts. Client wasn't Lee Molina, but the co-owner of Brain Porn and Major Tool guy had a freak BD wreath accident. Thought he was a BD star. Thankfully, he managed to convince him otherwise. You know, it's funny, I didn't think Lena was all that attractive at first, but as that story wore on, she actually was pretty hot. Uh, I see. Would you like a pat on the back? A 21-gun salute. 
Well, now you have my mildest congratulations. Now, can I return to work? Dude, you're the one who sent that. You're the one who sent that to me. I just did it. Okay, how far? 750 meters. I guess we might want to go ahead. Color. Jesse's. Arch. Jackie's Arch. I don't know why I called him Jesse just now. Okay, how do we get to the street? <laughs> Here. Side of the roads coming on. All right, that one. I don't want to get hit by my own Jackie's arch. Those directions are really weird. It's like real GPS. This is like another crashed box, but I'm not gonna bother with it right now. Whoa, 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 what was that? I think I saw that before, but yeah, this. Oh, nothing, but I'll take it. What the heck, right? the rest of the way. It's not that far. Actually, you know what? Before we do that, let me drop off here. I got some junk I need to sell. What's the difference? Tier 5 ultimate? Iconic. Forces enemy to put a gun to their head. Yeah. Negative 10 ram cost for 30 seconds after performing a melee finisher. 20% health neutralizing the enemy with suicide. Oh, it is. Okay. It is different. All right. Need to remember that. Because I think I've got this equipped, but I don't have it. Uh. But I don't, I don't think I have the iconic version. I guess we can find out real quick, too. Yeah, I don't have any iconics equipped. Can't do it until we're at a Ripper dock, though. And it's not really worth it at the moment to... To stop at one, even though there's one right here. And it looks like we can upgrade some of our cyberware too. Basement layer. Been here before, Reed. Exactly like then. Remember the last time we had this convo? I do. And yes, the rules is not that different. Ah, V, you're here. It's about time, too. We're nearly done finalizing the plan. Trust restored between you two. Back on the same page, are we? Not exactly. Brings back a lot of memories, all this. One in particular sticks out. Before NC, we worked in Op in Colombia. Medellin. Song's Not first now, mission. Alex. We have enough to do without digging up ancient history. 
Nah, come on, Colombia. Tell me. What happened in Medellin? What was the up there? We had our size trained on a guy who sat on the Colombian president's back pocket. Sold him smuggled corp test. You saying the FIA pulls strings overseas? A lot of what we do doesn't get printed in the norm sheets. Anyway, we used stolen identities on that mission too. Things didn't go exactly as planned, but that's a long story. Let's hear it. Think we can spare 60 seconds. Hell, might even learn something about so me that'll prove useful. All right. Our person of interest was one Luis Hernandez, arms trading heavyweight. We aim to plant our own SA in his organization. Alex had adopted the identity of an engineer from Hernandez's entourage. She was our ticket in. She walks in to attend a meeting one day. She sees one of Luis's bikini model girlfriends prancing out on her way to walk his dopamine. Spending big money on Kit's luxury it was kind of his M.O. So what happened? Well, Somi had put together Hernandez's dossier. Problem was, an important detail slipped through the cracks. The engineer's abject fear of dogs. Cold sweat, shaky hands, soggy pant leg, that kind of fear. When the Doberman sniffed Alex's knee, she pats him on the head and says, who's a good boy? Then she went to pull up a chair at Hernandez's table. Before she could sit down, they had two barrels to her head and one trained at the base of her spine. How'd you get her out? Worked out though, right? We're all here now, together. Hmm, which can't be said for Hernandez and his men. We took any possibility of that from them. All thought of subterfuge went poof. We had to kick the door down. A rival cartel wiped them out. That was the official version. Okay, back to Night City, folks. With our sights trained on a new target. All these, yes, sir. Costume mm. disguises. What's this? Where did I see? There was a thing. That, oh, over here. Psychological evaluation. Kurt Hansen. Reason for our evaluation routine. Commanding officer's note, an efficient and effective soldier, direct communication, and natural rapport with subordinates has earned him the trust and respect at times overly assertive with his superiors. Reliable, consistent performance to date, one incident on record. Psychological assessment exhibits a moderate tendency for insubordination and individualistic behavior. Recommendation, maintain closer oversight from CEO while broadening his scope of responsibility in order to foster a sense of mutual trust and commitment. Performance outlook good. Recommendation for further evaluation, no. We parsed the intel from the shard Somi gave us. It's a solid foundation for the mission we want to run. Surveillance, recon, data gathering, planning, it's all done. It's high time we righted some wrongs of the past. Fuck off, Reed. Give it a rest, will ya? Nothing here's your fault. Woman's an adult, made her own decisions. Consequences caught no, up to her. No, she was manipulated. There was no one around who could have had her back. Here, V. Mission details on this. Alex has it right. Um, yeah, Alex, Alex has it right. nailed it. If anyone's to blame, it's Myers, not you. You might be right, but so am I. Right, our objective, to free Somi from under Hans's duress. Unfortunately, this ain't a normal rescue up, because well, she's been infected with something from beyond the black. So New York, New York, remains consequence New York, of her New service York. to the NUS Not New, 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 New York, New, 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 New York. Not about a pretend. I New, understand New, the tech wise yeah, and New, how. New York. The important okay. thing is, if she doesn't get treatment, it'll kill her. The cure is an AI that lives on a neural matrix. Hansen possesses said matrix now. We aim to seize it. What do we know about the neural matrix? So this neural matrix, how much do we know? 
Experimental tech nested in a mainframe that someone dragged up from deep beneath Dogtown. From a bunker, to be exact. Part of Project Sinusure, a joint U.S. Militech operation mounted in a bid to counter our Asaka soul killer. The Matrix itself is a functional container. It houses an AI from beyond the Black Wall, and its design lets the user deploy the AI for a specific purpose. In our case, to fix you and Songbird. You know, I'm beginning to realize that this is not going to work because we still have to do the final mission. And even after the final mission final in the base the game, right? All right. It doesn't Flynn, work I'm the here. way you think it's going to work. Answer to me with the net runners you already know. The meeting itself is our chance to get close to Song and the Matrix. Hanson hired the French duo because they worked for Militech years back. They know its security protocols inside out. Also, they're selling Hanson access codes. Handy when Songbird goes to extract the Matrix from the Sinusure mainframe. Hanson's gunning for data from what he knows was a secret Militech NUS research project. He has no idea the neural Matrix is in there, too. Runners, scans, and behaviorals we have. Now we just need to take those twins out of the equation. We know who they are, don't we? Well, let's ask and find out. Hey, Marik and Aurora Cassell. We know anything more beyond what we saw firsthand. Yep. Songbird put together full profiles for both. Super short brief. They got their start at Militech and dove in deep. That is, till they learn the pay's better on the dark side. I buy that. Sure didn't hide their love of Eddie's. Mm-hmm. Gonna miss that next paycheck, because they ran into us. We're gonna nab them before they reach Hanson. Kidnapping them. So we kidnap them. How we want to do this? They're driving a rental while in NC. An exploitable opening. We're gonna track their ride and hijack it. Before they reach Hanson at the stadium. That's where you come in, V. We'll need you to breach the rental firm's tracking system. Addicts will fill you in later. Once we have the runners, you'll take their place. The behavior imprints are tuned already. It's your role. And your role in all this, Reed? I'm drawing up your exfil route. Once you complete the mission, you need to get out in a hurry. I'll provide transport, make sure the path's clear and problem free. The last stage meet with Hanson? Brings us to the final stage, right? Meeting with Hanson? Right. Where you'll sell them the access codes to the mainframe. In other words, the key to unlocking your medicine cabinet. One of you will join Somi in the lab to feed in the codes when needed. Hansen's likely to keep the other at his side. Collateral. I'll stay with Hansen. You'll join Songbird. Once the data floodgates are open, you'll signal me. Then to disarm Hansen, take him and his guards out. Oh, shit. I got a feeling Alex is gonna die. Think you'll be okay on your own? Hanson and his goons. Aim to handle them on your own? Can do a lot more than play dress-up, thank you. Plus, element of total surprise in my corner. Still, sweet of you to worry. You mean to kill Hanson? Sounds like Flatline and Hanson set in stone. Order came directly from Myers. Confirmed at the state. He took a potentially lethal swipe at the president of the NUS. And Songbird? We have to rescue her. Maya's told you as much as hell. All clear? If you have any questions, now's the time to ask. All right, tell me again what's first. What's your overall goal again? How much does Myers know? What'd you tell her? How much have you told Myers? What's she know? That Somi's fallen into the hands of the man who's organized the downing of Space Force One. Is that all? All for now. All right. Things couldn't be clearer. Let's get to work. So, time we talked about nabbing the runners? Cover that in a minute. Got another uh, gift for me? Carjacking, let's talk. Okay, any for your thoughts? And any for your thoughts, Alex? About all this? Honestly, still wondering why neither of us went back to D.C. Not me, not Reed. They put him to sleep. Saddled you with the Dogtown assignment. Who are you kidding? Say we disobeyed orders, gone back. 
A dressing down by some bureaucrat would be the worst we'd have had to endure. Think... Think we were both waiting for something, like the downing of Space Force One. Probably makes us a sad fucking pair of hypocrites. Myers doesn't know the deets of this op, does she? Myers doesn't know the deets of this op, does she? Never will. Is that right? It's not wrong. Plausible deniability. So, we serve Hansen up on a silver platter. It'll be salutes and handshakes. Shit goes sideways. We're royally fucked. Welcome to the agency. Reed, what's Reed's priority? You know Reed better than I do. What he thinks? What's his true aim here? Saving so me or carrying out a mission? Saul imagines he's responsible for her. Always has. Thinks he's responsible for all of us. Hell, even for you, I bet. It's how he keeps his grip on reality. Life. With mixed results, mind you. <laughs> and so me? Same story as always. Dares, lands neck deep in shit, somehow crawls out. Rinse and repeat. Alright, let's talk about the car check. Intercepting the runners. How do we do that? They're driving a rental. Plans to break into the rental service system. Karen Exotics. Specializes in rare models. Karen has tracking stations around the city. Gain access to those? We find the car easy. There's a station not far, near Pacifica Serenity Bible Church. Check it out. Uh, how do these tracking stations work? Stations. How do they work exactly? They ping vehicle IDs across the network. Monitor location, tire pressure, all of that. Hack them, and it'll be open season on the runners. One station might not be enough. I find it hard to believe taking one station will be enough. Rental agency's got rare rides to protect. Hmm. See if I can find more info. If the one's not enough, we'll improvise. So breach the station, trace the car. Good, what then? Use this little doodad. It'll pop the locks on the doors, let you take complete control from the trunk. I gotta be in the trunk? <laughs> Sounds easy enough. Okay. Look, sounds, smells, ah, it sounds easy enough. Sounds simple enough. Tech worth tens of thousands can help any plan go off like a dream. When you think you're near a station, scan your surroundings. They're not concealed. Shouldn't be tough to spot. Get right on it. Okay, so we completed that. Okay, where is my... There we go. I don't really mess with the with the mini games or the arcade games that are going to call them. Okay, how far are we going? 150. All right. Well, that might be worth calling our vehicle, or if we gotta get lucky with the fast travel. Oh, but yeah. Is this where the Voodoo Boys were, I wonder? Yeah, I think it is. That looks like a zombie. This is the tracking station transceiver. What would it look like? Okay. We're still in Pacifica, 
or we not. One, take care of your own. Two, don't cheat your own. The rules don't get any sense. Shit, there's a lot of them up here. Okay, you gotta get crippled. And then maybe a little contagion. Maybe let's get back to our weapon. Or our gun, I should say. <laughs> our shooting weapon. Tier 5, Tier 4, Tier 3 components. Nice. B, heads up. I can't talk long, but two things, quickly. First, good news. I managed to upgrade your relics firmware. You'll see what I mean in a minute. Don't worry. Completely painless. Impressive. Relic upgraded. How'd you manage it? No easy feat, I'd guess. Tweaking tech that advanced. Mm, let's say I've had extra time on my hands. More than I expected. Don't worry. We're getting you out of there. I know. First good news, you said. So there a second thing? Right. It's super important. Stays between us. It's gotta. Proof of my trust. I'm sending you coordinates. Come after dark. We should be able to talk freely. Okay, need to Delta. We'll see you soon. Sweet songbird between 11 and 1 a.m. All right. Let's go ahead and access this. Great. Just great. I got a problem, Alex. 
Gonna take more than breaching one station to recreate the encryption key. Fuck. Give me a sec. Okay, got another station for you to try. Let's see, let me try a remote link. Hold on, let me ping the station remotely. Try to save us some time. Clever. No response. Think standing around's gonna help? Mm, it might. Uh, let's get it done. Let's get to it. Good luck out there. And raise Reed as soon as you grab that encryption key. Okay, so what time is it now? 9 p.m. And then where do we meet Alec? I mean, Songbird? So me? Second tracking. Okay, was that maybe just a different, a whole different mission? Oops. Songbird between 11 and 1 a.m. Um, yeah, you know what? Let's go ahead and speed up time. Oh, wait a second. A relic. I forgot about that. A uh, relic. So we've got three points. What did she do? I don't have optical camo. Although that may not be a bad thing now that I think about it. We might need to visit Ripper Dock before we proceed. So how many is this? This is three. All right, we're just gonna keep those relic points in our pocket then. Oh, we do have an attribute point though. Let's go ahead and get this to 20. And I'm not gonna worry about the perk point for the moment. This was just one, I'm not gonna go through every single permutation of what we could use. You know what, what am I doing? Let's call her Jackie's Arch.
Oh snap! movement. Oh, this must be it. Both tier 5 plus. This one actually has a little bit more effective range. 50%. Headshot damage is the same. A little bit longer lock on time. Yep, you know, we'll just keep it to what we got. We haven't been using it that often anyway, so... I think we'll be okay. Oh, wait a second. Forgot about this. Or something? Yeah, looking for Won't this. find it here. It's nothing to find. Gone. As soon as I see to a transceiver. That your mom? Hey, that your mom? She doing all right? Uh huh. She's fine. You sure about that? Don't know. Maybe you ought to tell someone. Nah, she just came down from two days of BD. She'll wake up soon, snarf a scop dog, and cry about having a headache. She always does that. Alright, uh port transceiver need to fix it. Be gone. As soon as I see to a transceiver. Transceiver. Need to jack in quick. Two sucks and I'm gone. You do you. <sighs> Borked. Damn. It ain't working? <gasps> Jesus. You want a hint? I can tell you how to fix it if you really want to fix it. Old people need help with this stuff sometimes. <laughs> All right. So, yeah, turn it off first, then turn it back on. You know, I can tell you where to look for the on button for a thousand ads. Interested? Uh, uh, yeah, you know what? Let's do it. Okay, Eddie's are all yours. Nova. Done deal. So, Switch, where is it? I don't know exactly. Around here. Oh. Telling you where to look, not where to find it. Just like I said. All right. We'll play hot and cold. If you're close or far, we'll holler hot All right, or cold. All right, that's a little bit better than the Let's Fallout 4 kid. You'll get it. At, uh, I can't remember that trading area. I'm not hearing any hot or cold, kid. Colder! Right. Ice cold! Warmer! Getting hot! Warmer! Getting hot! Warmer! Ah. What the fuck? <laughs> 
<laughs> My BD! <laughs> That's the best fucking bit, too! Jankass power grid? <laughs> <They're back laughs> on, what a <laughs> ridiculous, you got two not necessary. Fixes. Hard reboot or hard kick? <coughs> oh, shit. Yo, yo, yo! Don't even think about <laughs> flatlining here! <laughs> I ain't gonna touch a corpse! <clears throat> this. There's gotta be what having a fucking stroke feels like. Fuck me. Ugh, this fucking sucks. Preaching to the choir. Start on track in Aurora and Amer Americ as soon as they're near dog time. We'll know we're in business signal from trackers left. Don't forget once you get the green light from S, contact me immediately. We're at a point now where a delay can sabotage everything. It does seem, I guess there could be a range. Reply to Alex's message. Uh, sure, we got time for that. Or is it a giffy? <laughs> mm. Wait, did I just miss out on... Oh, come on, dog! Uh, where are we going now? Is this not Songbird? No, that's... With Alex. Oh, come on, man! What time is it? Twelve twenty-three. Ah. So you guess you can't do both. Another thing we'll have to wait and try to do the other the opposite next time we've been doing it. Thank you. 
Report directly to John More news to come shortly. to you, Canalito. I don't think I'd recognize you on the street today. Hey. If I hadn't I fast forward time, that might have... Got a head start. A drink to calm the nerves. Uh, I think... me with the invite. You know, surprised me with the invite. Surprised? Really? Didn't know what to make of it. But yeah... It's nice to press pause once in a while. I wrote you because... Because I needed someone to talk to. Someone outside the firm. And not some total rando. To take my mind off the mission. Not worry about being someone else for a millisec. Hope that makes sense. What do you want to talk okay. about? Okay. So, what do you want to talk about? I mean, it's not like I have an agenda typed up. I just oh want my God. to be a normal fucking person for a little bit. I feel like this was a mistake. Myself, specifically. Just me. But I'm not just gonna... Just Alex. I'm not gonna... Save scum. My mom's like, gonna... Now I understand you push for retirement. Starting to make a lot more sense why retirement was your condition to accept the mission. Guess you'd call it burnout. Or maybe just the need for anything resembling normal. If I even know what that is anymore. Yeah, she's dead. Say, you ever think about who you'd be now? If, you know, life had taken a different turn? I'd still be with the backers. Maybe I'd still be with my family. Out on the road. As in nomads? Mm-hmm. The backers. Probably somewhere in the Midwest right now, scraping together a few eds from the corn harvest. Then long conversations over beer. Isn't it time we join Snake Nation? Soaking in that big sky. Or the stink of chew in some rat hole motel. <laughs> or that. To your health. Okay, now you. Who would you be, if not a secret agent and master of disguise? An actor. No hesitation there. Always dreamed of seeing my face on a show bill. I love musicals especially. Seriously? <laughs> Call me old fashioned. So yeah, guess I'd be a brain dance star. Hmm. <laughs> you're good at pretending to be someone you're not. Yep, a dream role. Got any dream roles? Norma Desmond, <laughs> Sunset Boulevard. <laughs> Guessing that doesn't ring any bells. Not a single one. No surprise. It's ancient, far as films go. I have a soft spot a play for tragic before characters. A film. Not to mention, I see something of myself in her. 
Neither of us know when to let go. I'll keep my fingers crossed for you. No matter how this ends, Alex, got my fingers crossed for you. And I got mine for you. Shit. And my toes. You got your shit crossed? Sounds painful. Ooh, I love this song. You know, I probably could have been getting some really good intel from Songbird right now, Alex. time is it what time is it oh yeah we missed it might as well dance then don't do this often I'm guessing do what exactly? This mean doing shit. Just cause. No forethought. Carefree relaxing. All right, V is not the best answer, I guess. I don't even, can't even tell what she's doing. She's kind of lifting one arm and then the other. It'll be a star someday, I know it. We'll see you on BD posters in no time. I know it. First, retirement. See you soon, V. Yeah. See you soon. Oh, it still says that we can do this. Okay. Is that fast travel? Really gonna pull your weapon on a bargain, soldier? I just want to get out of here. I don't need any trouble, guys. the face is gonna get sure we're alone wouldn't want any unpleasant surprises no surprises except maybe you're already one of us don't trust a soul this spot didn't pick it at random i guess guess right wanted to show you something it means a lot to me could help put some things in perspective And it means I trust you. All right, so me, let's do it. Come over here. I mean, not that. This. <laughs> okay.
So what's so special about this place? Lived just two blocks off while I was here in NC on assignment. Locals come here after sunset. Fire up grills, crack open beers, talk about nothing in particular. I'd swing by here come evening sometimes. All of it, every inch is special. It is pretty cool. Reminds me of Brooklyn, actually from there. Wouldn't mind hearing about it, Brooklyn. Mm. Got this memory. It was the night before I raided a Militech data form. I'm sitting out on my fire escape. Just lit a J. Down on the street, I see a party starting. There's playful screams and laughter. Someone's blasting funk from their stoop. I hear Willie, too. Sells the best scoff dogs around. He's shit-talking one of his chews, and there's bonfire smoke in the air. Safe. Familiar. Were they celebrating something? Yeah. A Thursday. <laughs> as long as where your people are, not some place. Yeah. Know the feeling. Got a place you hold close to your heart, too? Not a place. That was always changing. The people? Sure. Memories of home. You want to go back? You're an in to go back. Can't rewind the clock, V. By the time you realize you miss something, it's usually too late. <sighs> Suppose we should get back to the here and now. Attack on Myers. You schemed it up with Anson. I know that. Yeah. Neural Matrix was pricey. But honestly, I... I never thought he'd try to kill her. You betrayed her. Not just her. Nothing went according to plan. What a fucking mess. Lots of people died because of you. Sent Myers' entire flight crew to an early grave. Myers herself too, almost. Ground the plane. That was a plan. Didn't expect he... Blow it to shit. Not much of an excuse, I know. What'd you envision? So what was your plan? For you to rescue Myers while I secured the AI Matrix, and for us to run. All before Kirk caught on. Now Hansen's changed the terms of our deal. They'll make him answer for the attack. He knows that, so he's covering his ass. The one thing he doesn't know is what's on the Sinusure mainframe. He's hoping it's data he can use as leverage against the NUS. Says that's my ticket to freedom, but... As soon as he gets his hands on it, I'm dead. I just know it. It fucked everything up, I know V. But I had no choice. Help me understand why. Still don't understand why. Wasn't any other way, honestly. Wouldn't have resorted to this if there was. From Myers, the NUSA, um, just another weapon in their arsenal. A tool for reaching beyond the Black Wall. And weapons and tools, they don't get to make decisions or choose to retire. Sounds... Sounds painfully familiar. Think I know how you feel? I know. Anyone understands this feeling as well as you do, V. You're the only one I can trust with this. Only question is, after everything you just heard, you feel the same way about me? You could just go home. What's happening to you exactly? Wait, what about Reed? Don't trust him. Don't trust Reed? Guy wants to save your life. Mm-hmm. He saved me once already. Word of a boss shit on Militech crossed his desk. 
So he knocked on a 19-year-old girl's door with an offer she couldn't refuse. Join and serve, or become a Netwatch trophy. That girl died that day. The person in front of you is what was born from that death. Of course, Reed, he died too. Just more recently, seven years ago. The NUS issued his death sentence, yet he serves the country to this day, clinging to something that's lost all meaning to me. What's happening to you exactly? The one to ask, actually. What happens exactly, you know, when you reach past the black wall? Now the feeling when you try to remember the address of a place you lived half your life, but it just turns up blank. I mean, losing your memory? A snowflake lands on my glove. I can calculate its unique fractal structure. But what did my mom's voice sound like? Sometimes I, I lose control or get the sense I'm surrendering to someone else, but it feels horrible. Delta 2, with the Chimera, like a living nightmare. Yeah, more and more I get the sense someone's standing behind me, but there's never anyone there. You could just go home. I'm sure she can't, but let's exhaust all of these dialogue options. Why not just go home? My home burned down when I was forced to trade warm Brooklyn brick for sterile Washington walls. I have nowhere to go back to. And when I lived in New York, I um, never made it, spent much time in Brooklyn, mostly Manhattan. And I tell you, I honestly believe this, that yeah, if you're from Brooklyn or you live in Brooklyn or like that's the only place that you can live in New York, you take it on as like Brooklyn's the best. But I guarantee you anybody from Brooklyn would, if they could live in Manhattan, they would do it in a second. Uh, first time you've been honest with me. Get the feeling this is the first time you've been honest with me. Yeah. With you and myself. I tell you, this does feel more real than Alex's. I need to get away. From Kurt, then USA, Reed. From everything. Hanson, great taste and allies right there. Speaking of... Out of everybody out there, you saw Hanson as a trusty ally. Seriously? I needed someone who could tear me from Meyer's grip. I knew him from my time in Night City when I was posted here. Took a steep risk, all right. And a plain gonk one at that. I know, That's I That's why I enlisted you, too. Night City is just a pit stop along your escape route. That was always the plan, wasn't it? Yeah. It's just... things got complicated. Messy. Certainly didn't expect my old agency chooms to get involved, or to find myself caged by Kurt. I'm fleeing, V. Gotta get out. And to do that, I need you. Cause you... you know how it is. I have any guarantee you're telling the truth? How am I to know this isn't an elaborate con? Be nice to have some kind of guarantee. I can't give you one, sorry. But I've shown you my trust. I mean, you're free to sell me out to Reed, right? Or trust me enough to save us both. No guarantee for either of us. Fair deal, I say. All right, your plan exactly? Okay, say I believe you. What's the next step? We go through with the mission, grab the neural matrix. While Reed and Alex grapple with Hansen, we make our getaway. And then... Uh... You help me skip town. I already cut a deal with the Black Clinic far, far from Night City. There, the Rippers can access the Matrix and use an algorithm to create a prototype of our cure. They'll need me present to run their tests. The moment they're finished, I'll send word. And... that's it. 
Everything. Like a weight off my shoulders, honestly. Now, I have to ask. You're in this because you understand me? Or because I promised to save your life? Because you promised to save my life. I'm gonna survive just like you do. Should be pretty clear I mean to survive, too. I appreciate your honesty. <sighs> I guess that's all. I suppose you should call Reed. Let him know all set for the meet with Hansen. I'm gonna call Reed. Reed status report. Nice to talk to you too. <laughs> Reed, hey. I'm Nova, thanks. How are you? Put a cold beer in front of me once this is all over. Then we'll have time to chat. For now, fill me in on what you managed to get done. Talk to Songbird. So me contacted me. Got news. Let me hear it. Well, first off, we've been greenlit. Our VIP's ready to be served. Music to my ears. What else? Songbird opened up a bit. Better sitch. It's looking bad. Real bad. This tech's her only shot. I hear you. I do. All the more reason to focus on the mission in front of us. Get our hands on that cure. But Reed, what Somi spilled, we really need to talk. I know, but later. Not a topic for the hollow. V, one other thing. You need new chrome. An implant that accommodates behavioral imprints. I'm sending you deets for a clinic. The doc will be expecting you. Oh, cool. Because we need to go to the Ripper Dock anyway. War trinkets. She know you came with my blessing. Alright. Thinking about our Conversation couldn't shake the feeling of the deja vu. You awaken a memory that had faded, one I can enjoy again. Memory of what? Another conversation I had once with a close friend, honest, real, no ulterior motives. V, after all those years with the agency, questioning every word, every gesture, every twitch, what was looking over my shoulder? Do you know what that's like? Can't say it relates. And you know what? Unfortunately, I do. Guess this March I've seen in you what I've seen in the mirror for this for some time now. A trapped animal that hasn't lost hope for freedom. All the more reason we need to stick together. Sort of got it. This is the Ripper Dock that's right near the Moth. I'm gonna be disappointed. All right, I don't think it is. I think it's a different. You know, I haven't seen one of those relic point thingamajigs recently. Hello? Hello? You Farida? Yes, and we're closed. I hear you collect souvenirs from the Unification War. Got something... Might interest you. I doubt it. Here you collect trinkets. Unification war era. Mm-hmm. Come in. I'm sorry I was unwelcoming. Ever since a certain space plane crashed nearby, I've had to be more cautious. V, good to see you. Oh, hey, Reed. What's going on? Who would have thunk? <laughs> Here to see me? Things are in flux. Situation's changing fast. The 
thought we should talk. I'm here about Somi. I spent hours wrapping my head around this, putting myself in her shoes. I needed to understand what she must have been going through too. To resort to treason. Nope, can't understand you're not dying. She changed over those seven years. I'm sure you got your priorities right? Okay, I'm gonna go with the now yeah, you're not dying. Well he did die though. She changed over those seven years. Basing your expectations on the woman you used to know. Not on who she is today. Common denominators remain in place. She's trapped. Not just here and now, but going months back. Hell. Actually years. I blame Myers, a sore loser. Does her damnedest to avoid it. Songbird, the black wall, dirty tricks meant to give her a competitive edge. It's no wonder Somi doesn't trust anyone. Except maybe you. A little. That you or Somi would trust you instead. Song should trust you, not me. That it? I can't say I really blame her. I can only blame myself. But could you have done anything differently? Something. Anything. Instead of giving in and being exiled in Night City a couple thousand miles away. Lombard's going to prison. There's a prison cell prepped and waiting for her already. Somi knows that full well. She lives to see tomorrow and every day after. That's what matters. Myers needs her alive, sure, but forgive and forget the attempt on her life? Never. Myers might not forgive her, but doesn't mean I can. Somebody tried to kill you, too. You forgetting? Woman tried to zero you, too. Her hand's been forced too many times in her life. She's due compensation. Okay. We break the chain Hanson wrapped around her neck. Then what? We stow away somewhere safe, ask some questions, establish some common ground. Once I get the answers I'm looking for, I'll personally help it disappear from everyone, everywhere, including Myers. What are you going to ask her? Want to ask her a few questions, huh? To understand her side. Got an idea already of what I'll hear. System broke her. Almost took her life. Like it did mine. As for me, well, my time's well past. But so is still worth saving. Uh, believe you. Say I believe you. Where's your plan go from there? I got contacts in Europe. We'll find the best clinic. Put you two back together, fix what's broken. Once we have your cure in hand. But I need to help Somi first. She's lost, and I'm concerned she doesn't know what she's doing. You don't trust her? What I don't trust is the shit from beyond the black wall and the attendant paranoia. Both in play here, I'm afraid. She has another plan in mind. I'm damn sure of it. She told me her plan intends to escape. So me, she reached out. Wasn't telling the whole truth before. Once out, off the grid. Has it planned for right after we take down Hanson. Gonna make a run for it. Slip out of Night City. I thank you, V, for your candor. This means a lot to me. I have something for you. Our best minds in D.C. cooked it up. Icebreaker. Silver bullet against any fortified netrunner. Farida will feed it into your system during surgery. Use that, and Somi will drop unconscious within a minute. We can't take any chances, and when she wakes up, she'll wake up at home. Someone could sense it. She could sense the breaker. Not talking about some run-of-the-mill runner here. It's meta-heuristic, hyper-aggressive tech, cobbled together by a literal army of experts. If she does sense it, it won't matter. No one out there, alone, could withstand somebody like this. Sure it'll be enough? You sure this soft will work? 
Doubt it's been tested on anyone at Songbird's level. From what they tell me, this program can anticipate what she'll do before she even thinks to do it. By the time you cut one thread, it's already found another. A precision-guided weapon designed to evade countermeasures. Does it work? Okay. How do I use it? Fire it up when you're both jacked into the mainframe. At that moment, Somi's door will be wide open. You just can't... You two can't just talk? Two of you could just, you know, sit down, talk it out. That's my aim, precisely. After you kidnap her. Not quite the same. We've come to a point where some options are simply off the table. Right now, we're focusing on saving your lives. Talking time will come later. This time I was on my way. I leave you in Farida's able hands. Call me once you're done here. The sooner we begin, the sooner we finish. No time to lose. Okay, no time to lose. Tush, meet chair. Okay. Anesthesia incoming. Don't worry, it's the good stuff. Relax and submit. An ID modding implant is complicated tech, true. But the procedure is surprisingly simple. To be honest, never heard of tech like this. Seems kind of sci-fi. This an FIA prototype? Mm-hmm. It was picked off out. the corpse of a Militech R&D project. Militech abandoned it? Not really. That, or <laughs> they sought to keep it off the books. Top secret. Mom's the word. Politics. Okay. Anesthesia's taking hold. Oh, it's not gonna let me do my upgrades, is it? Or the optical camo? Fucking my face up? You better not be fucking my face up. Oh, you did take my face off. Damn it. Oh, wait, no, that's probably the fake face, so I look like the one of the twins. There's the icebreaker. Please give me a chance to upgrade my other stuff. How many fingers am I holding up? Ha ha ha. Hey Johnny. <laughs> nice to see you in good form. Mm -hmm. You want something from me? To chat. Got no other options. You'll have to do. So tell me, what's it feel like to be a traitor? I got a choice? Come on. You know this is a lose-lose clusterfuck of a sitch. I ain't here by choice. At least you see that. Means they haven't turned you yet. Not completely. Come on, got iron in your hand. Gotta put it to someone's head. Pull the trigger. The master spy and the agent unloosed. Tragedy, comedy, or both. Tragedy with me is the victim, maybe? You just don't like him. Reed, I understand. But I don't get what you have against her. Let's just say I know where they're both coming from. Survival. It's her be all and end all. That and she's a walking, talking nuke. The kind that keeps making mistakes, never knowing which one's gonna set her off. That's a good point, Johnny. And Reed? Bastard and me are one and the same. If I hadn't ghosted the army, I'd have become a Reed myself. Live and die by our principles. That's the tragedy, V. 
Someone's going to play victim to the other's good intentions. Try not to forget that when you're standing over that fucking overgrown neuro drive. What would you do if you were me? Reed or Songbird? What would you do in my shoes, Johnny? I am in your shoes, dumbass. <laughs> For every That's god true. choice you make. But I can't do dick. But honest to God, V, not fucking around? I don't know. Got no goddamn clue. Great. It's all on me. Well done. The facial morph implant is online. Now all you need is a behavioral imprint. And do me a favor. Don't tell me what you need this for. Might see me again. Might pop by if I need anything else. Like right now. I if can't it will wait. let me. Can I? Kidding me. All right, let's see. Okay, now let's go right back and see. Oh, yes. Yes, I think it's gonna work. Oh, it's you. Yes? Can you. Uh. You open today? Hey! Open for base today? Today? Yes. Sit. And if you blab on, I may forget the anesthetic. Excellent. Okay. Let's go ahead and... Whoops. We can upgrade this. Might as well. Give us as good a chance as any. And we might as well do this. That's all we can do for now. And then, let's see, where... So this is 94 armor. This is 33. 52. All right, so this is the lowest, but it's... Closer attacking the enemy to less damage they deal. All right, I think this is the one we'll want to change. So let's see. Wow, that's 200. Wow, we might actually change a couple of these. Uh, where, oh, is this is it. Nano plating, carapace. Oh yeah, cellular adapter. What does this do? Explosion resistance, tech weapon damage, health, item recharge. But yeah, we don't really use any of that. So, oh, some dermal no. Fesnikov. proxy shield. Counter shell. Wait, where's no optical camo? Or did I? Maybe I'm misremembering. Ah, oh, here we go. Optical camo. I think this is going to be helpful to us. Let's see, let's see. What was it? Yeah, it's only minus three. It's only three less armor okay let's go ahead and do it and then what was that other one that was 200 an extremely durable subcutaneous shell made of genetically modified shit provides additional health regen plus 10 percent health regen rate per attribute point total total <laughs> current total 110%. That's actually not too bad. I like that. And then what do we got here? Carapace 32 plus 32% armor effectiveness when attacked from the side or rear. This is subdermal armor. Decreased enemy vision. Alright, yeah. Let's change the carapace. Wait, what's this? Oh. That's gonna take us take us up to our max. Cyber limit. 
but it's fine because we've got oh wow how did we lose armor oh because it's I got you because yeah it's thinking I want to in install that that's minus armor okay got it um so that's that what was this again closer an attacking enemy is 94 20 okay yeah we're good All right, well, boys and girls, I think that is a fine place to wind things up. Um, hope you like what you saw. Hope we see you next time. Until then, Palpatine out.